Hi there, my smarty pants. So we just finished reading the book, Edward the Emu. I hope you like that one, it's very cute. So we're gonna draw Edward ourselves, okay? So today you're gonna need paper, papel, pencil, lapis, and colors, colores. And I'm gonna show you step-by-step step how to draw an emu, okay? So I've got my pencil and I've got my crayons, all right? So we're gonna start with my paper right here. And I'm gonna try and scooch a little closer, there we go, so you can see real well. All right, so my first step is to draw, we're gonna make the top of his beak. Okay, can you guys see that? Yes, all right, I'm gonna make that a little darker. Okay, so there's the top of his beak. It's a little lopsided, but that's okay. <laughs> All right, now the sides. Okay, <clears throat> and then I'm gonna draw the bottom of his beak. Okay. I'm drawing in pencil so that if I make a mistake, I can erase. So that's kind of funny looking, but that's okay. All right, there's his beak. Now we're gonna put a line, a parallel line. That means it's next to the other one. Okay, the second line, it's parallel. And then we're gonna draw his nostrils. Okay, and then we're gonna start his eyes. Okay, so I needed two big ovals. Oops, there's tape there. Two big ovals. Okay, I'll make those darker. Maybe I should move this one down. Let's try that. There we go. That's that's more even. Okay. I'm gonna make those darker so you can see. This one too. Okay. Two big ovals. All right. Next, we're gonna draw his eyeballs. Okay. So make a big circle in each one. All right. And then we're gonna put a little highlight circle in each one. You guys see that? Yep. And I'm gonna color this part in. Okay. There's my little highlight circle. Color that in. Okay, let me bring that a little closer to show you the highlight circles. All right, you see those? There we go. Okay, keep that plugged in so it doesn't die on me. <laughs> All right, next, we get to use our colors. So emus are pretty boring. They're black and gray, but you can make them any color you want because we're artists and we can do that, yay! So, you get to use your crazy colors. And we're gonna put some eyelashes on him and some feathers, okay? So I'm just gonna put all my crayons here. I'm trying to keep them a little quieter today. All right, I'm gonna start with my black crayon for his eyelashes, actually, I'm gonna outline him. With my black crayon, there we go. And then while I'm here, color in his eyeballs. Alright, and then some eyelashes. Okay, other one. And the 
eyeballs, put some eyelashes, okay? And while I'm outlining, yeah, that's a good one. Let me outline his beak too. Now, I don't remember what color emu beaks are, but I'm just gonna use this one. Our little line. So that parallel line there is the top part of his beak and the bottom part. All right. And where did my black go? Let's make his nostrils black. Okay, we're almost there. Now I'm going to start adding some feathers. And really, I should have put this further down on my paper because I don't have a whole lot of room for feathers here. And you can use any colors you want. Okay, so there's that one. Make them super colorful. Uh -oh. And then, let's see, I'm going to start his neck feathers. Just a little bit right below his beak. Okay. And let's see. Too. Okay, so we're just going to use any colors you want. Okay. So we're mixing some blues and some purples. Oh, I think I need some green. Working on his neck. Okay, so purple. And let's see some orange. So I'm just using lots and lots of straight lines to make my feathers here. All the way around. You can also color in his beak if you want. Okay. Make him look super cute. All right, now do you have to use the same colors I did? No, of course not. You can make your Edward the Emu any colors you want, okay? But remember, we're just using lines around the face to make his, fur, his feathery head, and then we're using lines below to make his feathery neck because they do have a long neck, okay? So I hope you have fun with this. As you can see, they turn out pretty cute, okay? So have fun, guys, and I'll see you later. Bye.